Hello, welcome back to another video. We have a lot to get done today. So here's the deal. We are leaving town tomorrow. We are going to Oregon for like the week basically. Um, we're gonna see some family and some friends and we're gonna help my sister and my brother-in-law move to Idaho. I always like to clean the house before we leave town so when we come home, we come home to a nice clean house and not like an overwhelming mess. So that's what we're gonna do today. It is New Year's Day today, so by the time you guys see this, it is gonna be 2024, that is crazy. Happy New Year. We're just gonna get right into it. I'm gonna be honest, we have been letting the dishes pile up. Like, I cooked a lot yesterday, and then like breakfast this morning, and this is not typical, okay? We don't typically have a sink full of dishes like this, but I was like, you know what guys, I'm gonna be filming a cleaning video, so just leave it. It's just more content, you know? Now, I did get ready this morning. I typically would not get ready just to clean my house and pack for a trip, but it's New Year's Eve and we have some plans tonight. We're gonna go to the movies and go to dinner. So I went ahead and just got ready and now we're gonna get all of our stuff done. We need to get done. I'm gonna start off in the kitchen, get the whole kitchen cleaned, focus on the downstairs. The kids, uh, the boys cleaned their rooms yesterday and I like did a deep clean on Berkeley's room yesterday. So. That's all good. Real quick though, I got this candle warmer from Amazon and I have to share it with you guys. I absolutely love it. So instead of burning a candle, it's just melting the wax, like, like a Scentsy wax warmer type thing, but like reversed. So this bulb, there's a light bulb in here and it just warms the candle so it melts the wax. See how the wax is just melted? So, and it does, it throws the scent very well throughout the house and you can adjust like, the uh, intensity of the light bulb and you can also do a timer so like you can set it for four hours and that'll just shut off so i had to share that with you guys i have it on the buffet here in the hallway all right first things first we are starting off in the kitchen i showed you guys all those dishes that we have piled up in the sink and while that's not typical needs to be taken care of so i'm starting off with getting the dishwasher unloaded so then i can get all of those dishes loaded up into the dishwasher Conversing into the night sky When you took my hand said let's leave now Don't wanna be shy I will let my guard down Don't wanna be shy about everything that was on our mind talking to you gave me butterflies then you took my hand said let's leave now don't wanna be shy We got all the dishes loaded in the dishwasher and we got that going. So I have a few things that need to be washed by hand and I'm just going to use some Dawn Power Wash and a Scrub Daddy sponge and get all of this stuff hand washed.
my eyes and go back Play it in my mind A movie of us two, yeah We were happy at the time Can't remember what it felt like We used to be so strong That picture perfect sky now It looks so great and cold We've been playing here since 4 a.m. And you haven't said a word to me mm. Silent treatment, is this what it feels like When your heart is shaking, when it bleeds If it's over, just say it July got stuck out in the rain, but we danced around and didn't mind it. So young and reckless, baby, you and I fit just like a glove. But I guess that's over now. We've been playing here since 4 a.m. and you haven't said a word to me. Okay, I just realized. All of my cleaning rags are dirty like that is full so I gotta swap the laundry and get those washed and dried before I can like clean basically anything because those are like my rags I use just for cleaning so gotta swap the laundry Okay, we got all the laundry swapped around. We got the cleaning rags going, some towels, and now I have this basket of laundry here that I'm gonna go ahead and get folded. Silent treatment is this what it feels like? Once I get all the laundry folded, I'm gonna go put everything in the rooms where they need to be put away. I'm not putting them away right this second, but I'm just taking everything where it needs to go and then like, the boys have a couple of things and then my stuff just got set in my room. Berkeley will put her own clothes away. And so everything is put where it needs to be and now I'm gonna straighten up the pillows on the couch here in the living room. 
So I told you guys at the start of this video the reason that I am cleaning and getting my house in order is so when we come home from our trip to Oregon, the house will be clean when we get home. And I also need to clean Cash's dog bed because he is coming with us and we're going to be taking his bed with us also. So he got a bath the night before this and I want to get his bed all clean as well since we're going to be taking it with us to my mother-in-law's and to um, like a condo rental that we're staying at and stuff like that. I just want like the dog and his bed to be smelling good and nice and clean. So I'm using my new cordless vac uh, shark vacuum that Donnie and the kids got me for Christmas and I'm just vacuuming up as much as I can over in this corner where his black hair gets all piled up and then I would try to vacuum off as much hair off of his bed as I could so that way like it didn't have a whole bunch of hair on it when I put it into the washer and then I'm also vacuuming off the side of the couch where a lot of his hair sticks to as well. If you're a dog owner, you know the hair is real. <laughs> Once I am done getting that corner all vacuumed up and clean, I am moving over to the sliding glass door, just giving you an overview here of the dog nose and slobber <laughs> prints on the sliding glass door. I'm just going to use my Blue Land glass cleaner to get the inside and the outside all wiped down and clean. Words can't describe just how much I miss you whenever you're gone. I want you here beside me for eternity Shining your light like a sun I try for you, baby To take the higher road To be someone you're proud of But I've lost lately Now moving on over to the kitchen I just got a new delivery of my favorite Gorgy energy drinks So I'm going to get those unboxed and put in the fridge Now headed into the front room, office, guest room, whatever you want to call it. The kids hang out area, they like to come in here and play on the computer. Um, in my, I have like my, my big computer in this room and so it's kind of like our family computer that everybody uses and so the kids will get on there and play Roblox or watch YouTube videos or whatever and hang out in here and so they had all these blankets out. These are like all the blankets that we use whenever we have people like family and stuff come stay with us because this couch turns into a hide a bed. I found this couch on Facebook Marketplace um, for a really good deal and so anyways I had all these blankets just piled on the couch and the kids have been using them and like making forts and stuff in here so i'm gonna get all of those folded up and put back in the closet get the pillowcases that i just washed back on the guest pillows just get this room straightened up i have a pile of pictures sitting there on the table that i need to move around and stuff like that so we're just gonna get this front room put back in order and then also vacuum
Now continuing on with the vacuuming from the front room, I'm just going to keep on moving, keep on trucking with vacuuming the hallway here. Basically we're just going to vacuum this entire downstairs area because I am going to mop this whole downstairs area as well. So we're going to do this entryway hallway here and then move on to the hallway that goes to the laundry room. I'm going to vacuum the laundry room, the kitchen, the living room, and also the dining room. That's all I need, and I'll be all right. I'll be right here. I swear that I'll stay here with you. Hold me closer. I want to stay here with you. All that we have is each other. All right, everything is vacuumed and ready to be mopped. So now we're gonna move on to my bedroom. I need to just get this straightened up. We have the bed, honestly, I don't make my bed every day, um, but when I wanna like pick up my room and put everything away, I'll like reset my bedroom, if you will, I will make the bed. I used to make my bed every single day, but at our old house, you could see our bed from our living room. Like the foot of the bed faced the door and the door look like was off of our living room So I felt like I had to make the bed every day because I could see my bed all day every day and in this house That's not the case. So it doesn't really bother us if the bed isn't made So anyways, um, let me know if you guys make your bed every day or if you can like see your bed from like your main living area if that has an effect on if you make your bed every day so Made the bed and now I just have my pile of clean clothes I need to put away. So I got all of those put away and then getting some dirty clothes up off the floor. And then I'm also going to vacuum this whole room. Give me love, give me all your love. Now that I've got my room all cleaned up and back in order, I need to start packing. So I'm just going to plan out outfits and lay them out on my bed, kind of thinking about what we're going to be doing each day, what the weather's going to be like, and the vibe that I want, what outfit I want to wear, picking out shoes, and then just making sure that I have extras of everything as well, and just planning out outfits for the week while we're going to be gone.
Okay, so this is how I kind of plan things out. Um, tomorrow's a travel day, so I've got leggings, sports bra, underwear, and a sweatshirt for tomorrow. And then I'm going to wear my new Nikes that Donnie got me for Christmas with that. So I need some short socks for that. Forgot to put those out. And then I have outfits for the week out, like jeans, shirts, you know, sweaters. I'm going to bring my vest because I like to wear that over like long sleeve shirts and I have three of those. So I put like everything out for each day. And then Saturday is going to be like loading trailer, moving day, unpacking trailer at my sister's house and stuff. So I have another like leggings and sweatshirt outfit and then we'll be able to do laundry while we're gone also so I've got everything out here and my shoes that I'm gonna bring um, these boots my checkered vans my platform Nikes and those and then I'll also bring my slippers and then this is just extra stuff over here extra socks extra pair of leggings extra chonies and sleep shirts extra sports bra two pairs of sweatpants for lounging and then my regular bra that I have on that I'll throw in my bag later, but I'm gonna get all this stuff packed up in a suitcase. all packed up and then tomorrow morning I'll do like my hair stuff makeup skincare chargers because I got to bring like my computer so I can work while we're gone but I got my clothes and my shoes packed so Donnie will pack his own stuff and I'm gonna head upstairs and help all of the kids get their clothes packed got all of the kids stuff packed and ready to go and now we are back to cleaning so I got all the stuff out of the dryer we're gonna get that folded and I'm getting all my cleaning rags put into the dryer now and then I'm gonna get Cash's dog bed and his blanket started in the wash Ooh, and back to laundry I have this load here it was like towels and sheets and just some random stuff so I'm gonna get this folded and get it all put away where it needs to go Tell me, do you really need me? I'm painting pictures and I'm dreaming about that good love and something that I know you cannot give me. I know what I need, ain't gonna lie. I know what I want, stick in my mind now. A queen is a king to be by your side. We got clothes put away and now I'm going to vacuum the stairs. I will tell you I am vacuuming and it's clean, but there are some imperfections on these floors. Um, the painter, I think, got a lot of paint splatters on the floor when they were building this house and I don't think they ever came back to like clean that up. So there's a lot of little paint splatters everywhere. We're just renting this house, so um, it is what it is, but we noticed that when we moved in that there was just kind of 
a lot of little imperfections as far as like the paint goes and like little paint spots on the floor so if you guys ever see little white spots on the floor while I'm vacuuming it's paint so anyways I'm gonna get to these stairs all vacuumed up they get dusty really easily it's kind of hard to tell on camera but I'll be like walking up the stairs and kind of being like eye level with the other stairs I'm like oh my lanta there's a lot of dust so let's get that vacuumed Alright, the cleaning rags are done and the dryer. So we're gonna get those out and get those folded so then we can do some wiping. There really isn't like a lot of stuff I need to wipe down, but like the dining table needs to be wiped down, the kitchen counters need to wipe, be wiped down. And I'm just particular about what rags get used for like cleaning. And they're just these white Walmart cheap wash rags that I use and keep in my kitchen drawer. And those are the only rags we use for cleaning. So anyways. Not that you asked, but we're going to get all these towels folded, like my kitchen towels, cleaning towels. There was a couple of other towels in there too, but we're going to get those all folded and put away. I got all those put away and now we're gonna get Cash's blanket and dog bed put into the dryer and get that going and then we're gonna mop so I have my Bona mop and I ran out of the Bona mop solution so I just use water and thieves cleaner I think in my last cleaning video I told you guys that a couple years ago I stocked up on that thieves cleaner from Young Living and I just have bottles of the cleaner and it's like a concentrate so I use that in like my um, glass cleaning like spray bottles and then I also use it in like my mop bucket, my spin mop bucket and it works really well in the Bona mop too. So we're going to get all of these downstairs floors mopped. Remember the things that you told me They got me moving forward Times that we disagreed just cut my respect deeper i'm feeling that we are something really oh special when i look back on us it's starting to sink in don't want it to be misunderstood rolling in the deep don't want to break this I know I did it a little backwards and you're supposed to like wipe things down before you mop, but we, we didn't do that today. So check out my dining room table, very dusty, needs to be wiped down, but we're still mopping. So now I'm just taking my thieves cleaner, I'm gonna spray that down on the table and get that wiped down. Then we're gonna move on to the kitchen and all of those dishes that I hand washed earlier that have just been air drying, I'm gonna put all of those away and then we're gonna wipe down the kitchen counters. It was a thirsty night when I first saw you Those green eyes caught me Yeah, it was crazy It was a Friday night when I first kissed you you struck me like lightning You broke my chains and released me And they turned into nights on the couch in your apartment No, I am not the same Everything has changed Every day this video I got a ton of stuff done the floors are clean we are getting ready to head out to go to the movies and to dinner for New Year's Eve so the kitchen is 
done and clean there's gonna be no cooking in there until we get back from our trip so feels good to have the house in order clean picked up and then when we come home from our trip all I'll have to do is unpack our bags and do a little laundry. I won't have to do any cleaning. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had a fantastic New Year's Eve. And I wish you all the best in 2024. Love you guys. And I will see you again very soon in my next video. Bye.